hello welcome in previous video i have explained you the about the introduction of oic we have basic difference we have basic discuss about the component of oic in this video we will explain you the uh, components of oic in deep way so let's first talk about the adapters what is adapters 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 are endpoints of any integration solutions so that they can interact directly with the business applications adapters do the actual connection with the application resources and manage application transactions securely exceptions and so on it helps securely configure connection between integration cloud and other systems using authentication with username password and any other credentials if we will talk about the some example of adapters that can be oracle cloud erp adapters atp ftp file oracle e business suite adapter rest adapter soap adapter and oracle database adapter etc there are many more we have 77 adapters provided by oracle let's talk about agent what is agent why we are using agent in our integration so agent use agent is used to connect with on premise application with the cloud applications agent are used by oic to connect to on premise such as local database or local file server for example if you are using on premise system like ebs sap and also using oracle cloud oic is the simple implementation you would have to use an agent to connect to the oic application if we will talk in simple way what is agent so agent help us to connect make a connection between on premise application and the oracle cloud application next we have connection so we will talk about the connection connection are the various connect connect connectors that can be utilized to communicate with external applications communication can be done with connections conversational system like file ftp and so on also with new social medias and other application like linkedin facebook twitter gmail whatsapp so we have to create connections for all these adapters using all these adapters so that we can communicate with this kinds of application we need to create connection by using the adapter available so we have adapter provided by oracle we are using that adapter to create connection in adapter while creating the connection we are providing the credentials we are providing the urls we are providing the host port username password etc connections are based on adapters if we want to connect with ftp server we required ftp adapter to make a connection with the application next if we will talk about the things it will be lookups all lookup is also main features in oic it is used to provide mapping and integration we use lookups in the integration to create a reusable table that maps the different term used in describe the same items across the application so if we are using lookups we can use that particular lookups in all over the integration with the same instance for example lookup for country code country name it is like we are generally using right we are using lookup for country short name with the country full name for like uh, person gender like m for male f for female and so on next we have libraries in oic sometimes we require some operations right we require some validation we require some facilities that can be go through the processor so that kind of processor we can create in libraries libraries provide us the facilities where we can create our, our functions java script functions so in library we can create functions which can be used in integration functions are configured in the library editors page to be used in the orchestration canvas and also to export imports metadata and next we have package it is used to group together similar integrations so while creating the integration we can provide the package name so that all the integration with the similar package can be combined together right sometimes we require we created the integration on non prod instance and we want to put the integration to the prod instance so suppose for a particular development we have five integration 
so you have to import export all five application integration one by one and then you are going to import that application in prod so you can be you can use package for that so if you will create all this integration in the same package you can download the package at once you can export the package and import the package at once at another application now last and the most important part is that integration integration are the process that utilize connections among other things to implement a business process integration are the application which solves the business requirements it is used to automate the business processes so we are creating an application that called integration in which we automate the process process whatever business required so this is all about oic components of oic in next video we will talk about the another thing so if you like this video don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to like this video if you have any query you can comment below and want to ask anything if you want thank you so much for being here